Hi guys, my name is Shachi and welcome to another video. Today is a big day for me. I turned 30 today. Thank you so much to everybody who reached out to wish me. So the big 3-0, it's goodbye to my 20s. Lot of mixed feelings here. I am happy and excited for everything that is yet to come. But also sad that I'm no longer going to be a 20 year old. Deep breath. In this video, I have put together 30 things that I have learned in my 20s. Some of them are things that I've learned through my personal experience, some of them are things I wish I knew earlier, and some of them are just pure common sense. So, in no particular order, let's get started. What will people say? The four worst words that you can think to yourself. So, if you're holding yourself back from doing anything because of what will people say, think again. If you're a control freak, you're just making your life difficult. Take it from me, you're the biggest control freaks. If you want to experiment with your hair, 20s is the time for it. Don't send emails when you're angry. The number of disasters I could have avoided if I knew this. It's always good to wait for 24 hours before reacting to anything. This is one of the biggest learnings for me. Don't be too rigid. It's good to have structure, routine, plans. But life is life and there will be a ton of unexpected things coming your way. So go with the flow. To do a digital detox once in a while. So get out of those annoying WhatsApp groups. Unsubscribe from email lists that are no longer useful. Clear the digital clutter around. Keep half an hour a day just for yourself. And don't let anybody make you feel guilty about it. Nobody is really thinking that much about you. I mean, we constantly feel that what are people thinking about us or what do people say? But the truth is everybody is busy in their own life and they really don't have the time. The 80-20 is a golden rule and applies to almost everything, to your work, to your relationships, to your health. So if you don't know what the 80-20 rule is, Google it right now. People and relationships are what matters the most. So take time to cultivate deep, meaningful relationships. Looks do matter. A little harsh, but that's the truth. We all make snap judgments and we all form first impressions. So how you look and how you're groomed is going to matter. This one just had to be there. Your health and fitness is important and should be your priority. Taste buds do change, so good eating habits can be developed. And the sooner you do it, the better it is. An empty mind is a devil's workshop, so keep yourself busy. Don't depend too much on other people for emotional support or for entertainment. Just find ways to keep yourself happy and to spend time by yourself. The world is not black or white, so things are never completely right or wrong. They are just shades of grey. People are inherently good-natured. A lot of times we tend to get mad at others, but they are just doing the best they can, just like us. 90% of the things that we worry about are either inconsequential or imaginary. Depth always beats worth. We are trying to do so many things, but having in-depth knowledge about something will take you a long way. So do something every day to take care of your mind, be it meditating, journaling, whatever your thing is. Time goes really fast, especially when you're having fun and the years just roll by. All good things take time and effort, so it's good to have patience. Learn to stay calm. One of the best things that you can do for your body and mind is learning how to stay calm. No matter how difficult things are, remember that this too shall pass and you will come out of it. Do not expect too much from people, situations, life in general. Do the best you can and just forget about the rest. Invest in yourself. Spend money on yourself to make yourself better. So take that course, sign up for that class, get a personal coach, it's all going to be worth it. Venting and complaining feels good, but it's not helping you in any way, so stop. Feeling too comfortable in your job, in your relationship, in your city, change something. Because this comfort zone is going to kill your drive and your creativity, so get out of it. Express gratitude. Be happy for everything that is good in your life. So take a few moments every day to either write it down or say a silent prayer. I'm saving the best one for the last. Sunscreen is your skin's best friend. And this one is not just for the girls. So if you don't use a sunscreen, start using it now. 
So guys, these were the 30 things. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked this video and enjoyed the pearls of wisdom from a 30 year old. If you did, do give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. I'll see you very soon in the next one. Till then, take care and bye.